we're going to show you how to add, change, or update an item on one of these POUs. So with your P key, you're going to go ahead and go to the P position, which is program mode. On program mode, you need one, which is the first option, it's POU. You're going to go ahead and click cache, which is enter in this case. The first, second, third, and fourth options are quite important, but we're going to focus on the first one right now, which is add and change. We're going to focus on one again, which is just to add, change one POU versus a range of POUs, meaning you can set up one to 110 simultaneously with the same price or maybe add tax on all of them at the same time. So once again, we're going to stick with one, hit cash and it's asking you to enter the POU. As opposed to typing it out, because this is a 110 POU key keyboard, you can just go ahead and click any of the keys on 110. So we're gonna do one. Description is the name of the item. Right now it's POU one. Let's say it's a banana. So on your keyboard, there is an alphabet. So you can go ahead and just type banana. Once you're done, you hit cash or enter and you can go to option two. Now you can either scroll down with the up and down arrow or hit the number two key and it'll take you down a slot. You're gonna hit enter on that and you're gonna type in the price of your banana. Let's say it's dollar, you hit cash or enter. And another option that we'll focus on in another video will be option five, taxable by rate one. We haven't programmed the tax rate on this so we're going to leave it as no. If we had programmed it and we wanted to charge tax, you can go ahead and click yes with the up arrow, down arrow to go back to the end, which is no. I'm going to go all the way back to our program mode window and switch back to register mode. We're going to hit one and it should show you banana. If you wanted to update that price, we go through the same steps. Go back down to P mode, program mode, hit one, POU, hit add and change, hit one again for one POU. Now we're gonna click the same POU, which is one, and you'll see your information stored. You're gonna go down to $1, and maybe you're putting it down to 89 cents. You hit cash, and you hit clear. You need to go back to the program mode window because if you don't, the register won't let you move on. This is basically telling you to finish doing what you're doing. You're gonna go back to program mode and then you can switch back. And that's how you'll set up a POU.